my name is Evelyn Stewart. I'm the executive director of the Masser Museum of Art. I'd like to welcome you to the Masser. We are open on Tuesday through Friday from 9 until 5, and we are open on Saturdays from noon until 5, and admission to the museum is always free. The Masser Museum is located in a home that was built in 1929 by the Slagles. The home was then acquired in the 1930s by the Masser family. The Masser raised their three children in the home, and in 1963, their children donated the home to the city of Monroe to become a fine art museum. So we have been a museum since 1963. Hi, I'm Lindsay Carney. I'm the curator of collections and exhibitions here at the Masser Museum. And welcome to our current exhibition called Synthesis, Art and Nature in the Post-Digital Age. It's all about the relationships between humans, nature, and technology, and how technology is being used in the arts in order to mimic or even completely synthesize everything from biology and physics to uh, the human experience itself. Um, a lot of the artwork in this show was made using cutting edge technologies like 3D printing, digital painting and animation, um, or even vi uh, virtual reality. Um, and other works in the show use traditional media but comment on those same themes too. We have uh, works by an artist from Brooklyn named Shavana Smiley. Um, she creates these incredible shoe sculptures. This series is called The Venus of the Milky Way and it's all different uh, personalities of intergalactic goddesses that she has imagined that might wear shoes like this. And these two in the corner here are called Astronaut 1 and Astronaut 2. Um, the one on the right, Astronaut 1, is the guardian of Earth. She's our, our moon goddess protecting Earth. And Astronaut 2, uh, with the sort of space helmet design, um, is the explorer who goes out from Earth to explore new worlds. But they each have personalities and um, are absolutely fabulous, and she actually wears them too. They can be worn. <laughs> So here at Mazda Museum, we actually change our exhibitions four times a year, and we can show anywhere from six to eight, or sometimes even more than that, exhibitions every year. Um, we tend to focus on modern and contemporary art, especially from artists who live and work in the South. Um, but we show a little bit of everything, from historical styles from the 19th century up through um, styles from today. Uh, this gallery is full of work by two artists. Um, both of whom are based in New York. Uh, Sophie Kahn takes uh, 3D laser scans of the human body, which is apparently very difficult to do because the human body is never perfectly still, so every scan has glitches in it. And then she uses them to generate beautiful architectural prints and then eventually 3D prints um, those digital renderings into sculptures. 